subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi, welcome to Test Prep Training. Today we will discuss about, Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant. The Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant credential will help you demonstrate your expertise in implementing solutions within Salesforce Cloud. It will open new realms in your career by highlighting your skills, and experience. What is Salesforce? Salesforce is a cloud computing service company specializing in customer relationship management. It allows businesses to improve their connections with their customers, partners, and potential customers using cloud computing models. Salesforce is used in nearly every industry, and its reach continues to expand. Hence their certifications are industry recognized, and their demand is amplifying. Therefore Salesforce becomes the ultimate stop for businesses to grow their revenue, while increasing their customer base. Now we will talk about, about the Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant Credential. The Salesforce Certified Education Cloud Consultant Program is designed for consultants, who have experience in implementing Salesforce Education Cloud solutions in a customer-facing role. The Education Cloud Consultant is able to successfully design, and implement Education Cloud solutions, that meet customer business requirements, are maintainable, and scalable, and also contribute to long-term customer success. Why choose Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant Credential? Salesforce certification provides various benefits to professional career. Choosing the Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam will definitely escalate our employability. Here are some of the major benefits that a certification from Salesforce will guarantee you. First, Salesforce certifications help you to increase your marketability in a tight IT job market, as they enable you to become a subject matter expert. Second, Salesforce certifications helps in attracting the attention of your potential employers to your resume by making your academic records shine. Third, this certification helps you grab lucrative career options. Therefore, bringing career growth. Fourth, many Salesforce salary surveys show that Salesforce certified professionals get more salary, compared to non-certified professionals. Now we will discuss about, skills developed in Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant Exam. On completing the Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam, a candidate develops the following skills. First, experience in managing implementation projects for higher education. Second, strong analytical and problem-solving skills. Third, deep knowledge of Salesforce product lines. Fourth, solid understanding of internet technologies and cloud computing. Fifth, fundamental understanding of common integrations and higher education specific source systems sixth familiarity with governance and change management concepts seventh knowledge about the software development life cycle eighth understanding of salesforce environment strategy and how to build incrementally to serve a university's needs abilities of a salesforce education cloud consultant the salesforce education cloud consultant exam validates the following abilities in a candidate First, install, configure, and customize Salesforce Education Cloud solutions for higher education. Second, incorporate core Salesforce products like Sales Cloud, Service Cloud, Marketing Cloud, Pardot, Einstein Analytics, and Community Cloud with EDA. Third, ensure seamless operational continuity between core products and EDA. Fourth, understand limitations, product compatibility, and the application of best practices. Fifth, discuss integration implications and migrate data into an instance with EDA installed. Now we will discuss about target audience. The target audience for Salesforce Certified Education Cloud Consultant exam includes First, business analyst. Second, consultant. Third, application or solution architect. Fourth, program manager. Fifth, developer. Sixth, project manager. Seventh, database administrator eighth technical architect exam details the salesforce education cloud consultant exam comprises of 60 multiple choice questions which are to be completed in a time span of 90 minutes as for the registration fee it is 200 dollars following are more details about the exam exam details the salesforce education cloud consultant exam comprises of 60 multiple choice questions which are to be completed in a time span of 90 minutes as for the registration fee it is 200 dollars following are more details about the exam registering for the exam first create an account on web assessor second click register for an exam on the portal 
Third, click on the Salesforce Marketing Cloud Email Specialist exam. Fourth, expand the section to view the delivery options, and choose from. Fifth, on-site proctored. Sixth, online proctored. Seventh, then click on the register button after selecting your preferred delivery method. Eighth, if selected on-site proctored exam select the testing center, date, and desired time to take the test. Ninth, if selected online proctored select the date, and time for the exam. Tenth, click checkout after reviewing the exam and scheduling details. 11th, enter your payment type, and pay through your preferred mode. 12th, click Submit. 13th, a purchase confirmation screen would open, select Done. 14th, you will receive an email confirming your purchase, and registration. Now we will talk about, exam retake policy. In case you weren't able to pass the exam in the first attempt, you can go for a retest. The retake fee is, 100 US dollars. Salesforce offers you, three attempts in a year to clear a certification. Salesforce Certification Verification You can check your certification status on the verification page of Salesforce to keep track of your certifications, maintenance requirements, and account linking status. First, visit the verification page, and from the certification holders. Second, check your status box. Third, enter your web assessor email. Fourth, an email will be sent to you showing your credentials the required maintenance modules, and the due dates. Now we will discuss about, maintenance of Salesforce credential. The new system feature updates are released by Salesforce three times a year. Each update requires all certification holders to maintain their certifications, with trailhead maintenance modules aligned, with the Salesforce product release cycles. You can check your certification maintenance schedule at, maintenance exam due date. Exam outline. The Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam consists of the following six domains. First, Education Cloud Applications, Settings, and Configuration, which compromises 23% weightage for this exam. Second, Implementation Strategies, which compromises 18% weightage for this exam. Third, Solution Design, which compromises 19% weightage for this exam. Fourth, Domain Expertise, which compromises 19% weightage for this exam. Fifth, Integration, and Data Management, which compromises 17% weightage for this exam. Sixth, Analytics, which compromises 5% weightage for this exam. Let us now discuss about exam outline topics in detail. Number 1, Education Cloud Applications, Settings, and Configuration, 23%. It contains. First, Explain the capabilities, and limitations of education data architecture, including compatibility with other Salesforce products, and features. Second, install, and configure EDA. Third, install, and configure advisor link. Number two, implementation strategies, 18%. It contains. First, given a scenario, determine how to facilitate a successful implementation, plan, gather requirements, design, build, test, document, deploy, and optimize. Second, advise on governance, change management, staffing, and adoption best practices, including community resources for long-term solution success. Third, given a scenario, identify timing considerations for a successful deployment. Number three, solution design, 19%. It contains. First, explain the similarities, differences, and relationships between EDA account models, and standard Salesforce account contact data models. Second, given a scenario, design an appropriate, and scalable solution for a higher education customer. Third, know where to find available open source solutions. Fourth, given a scenario, determine when it is appropriate to use EDA, other Salesforce solutions, open source solutions, and third-party applications. Number four, domain expertise, 19%. It contains. First, determine the Salesforce solutions that satisfy customer requirements for marketing and engagement. Second, given a business challenge, determine the Salesforce solutions that satisfy customer requirements for recruitment and admissions. Third, determine the Salesforce solutions that satisfy customer requirements for student success. Fourth, given a business challenge, Determine the Salesforce solutions that satisfy customer requirements for advancement, and alumni relations. Number 5, Integration, and Data Management, 
it contains. First, given a scenario, explain integration considerations for connecting higher education systems in an education cloud implementation. Second, given a scenario, explain data migration considerations in education cloud. Third, given a scenario, analyze the implications and design considerations of large data volumes. Fourth, given a scenario, explain data management considerations in education cloud. Number six, analytics, 5%. It contains. First, given a scenario, determine the appropriate reporting solution in education cloud. Second, given a scenario, explain the security and data visibility considerations when designing reports and dashboards to serve different personas. Preparatory guide. Step one, clarity of exam objectives. The objectives of the exam must be very clear in your mind. You should have complete clarity about the exam details before venturing into the preparations. You should surely visit the official website of Salesforce to have a better clarity about the Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam. Step two, download the exam guide. The next step is to download the exam guide for then Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam. The exam guide provides the authentic details about the exam course. Remember to refer the exam guide to have prior knowledge of your course that too in details. Download the Salesforce exam guide. Step 3, Books, The Ultimate Friends. Books have always been the most preferred resource, while preparing for any exam. They provide in-depth clarity about the subject. There are a great number of books available for the preparation of Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam. Step 4, Strategize a Study Plan. Remember that the key to prepare well is to start early. You need to devise a study plan keeping in mind the course modules and the time duration left till the final exam. Always start by working on your weaker sections. A study plan will help you avoid distractions. Preparing each day and following your plan will help you maintain consistency in your preparations. Step 5, Go for Salesforce Training. Salesforce provides its own training course for the Salesforce Education Cloud Consultant exam. This training course can be accessed online. Salesforce Trailmix provides the exam training course. Training courses help you follow a guided path with tutorials and increases your chances of clearing the exam. Also, it helps you in learning how to implement education cloud solutions, thereby preparing you for the exam. Step 6, Join the Community. Online forums and study groups are a great way to prepare for the certification exam. Therefore, get in touch with other candidates through study forums and get a chance to learn from their experience. Salesforce's own community known as Trailblazer community helps you collaborate and study with your fellow candidates. It also helps you to connect and get answers from this very passionate community. Step 7, Practice Test. We know that practice makes a man perfect. Including practice tests in your preparation guide is a must. It helps you check your preparations and also identifies your weaker areas. Strengthening these areas will surely bring success. Practice tests are designed to provide the real exam environment to you. Also, Attempt as many tests as you can. The more you practice, the better you become. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.